y'all good morning if you're new here welcome make sure to like comment subscribe and a returning subscriber what's up thank you so much for coming back it is really early right now but this is honestly my favorite time of the day the world is quiet it is still and it's really just a time where i can sit with myself and my thoughts and just like reflect i think it's like really important to have a moment in your day that really belongs to you it's a time where i can just like really just sit with myself sometimes i might even fit in an inspirational podcast episode of some sort i just love listening to other people's thoughts i just have a feeling that 2024 is going to be a great year much of 2023 was just me really adjusting to motherhood and my new life as a mom essentially and not easy at all but maybe we'll like you know dive into that um in another video one of my biggest goals this year is to really just like embrace the journey and to use this time to really just like rediscover who i've become as a person which i think is really important because when you become a mom you essentially become a whole new person so the things that you might have like you know really enjoyed in the past things that might have like you know sparked joy curiosity happiness might not hit in the same way anymore it's really easy to lose yourself when you become a mom but i also think it takes a lot of you know courage and grace to rediscover yourself i've had a lot of like creative pursuits as well that you know i had to put on pause after becoming a mom because i was just so overwhelmed and there's just so many other things that are like occupying space in your mind and you don't really have the time or even like the energy to really think about you know like those things that bring you joy in that way and there's just so many other things that are like occupying space in your mind and you don't really have the time or even like the energy to really think about you know like those things that bring you joy and for me it's always been creating my creative process might not look like how it used to look you know two three two to three years ago when i wasn't a mom i've definitely been falling in love with um content creation as of recently and i really do think that it's a form of creative expression it's actually one of the reasons why i decided to start my youtube channel this year it's a way for me to not only document and romanticize my life i've always loved um you know using video as an artistic medium to tell a story and this is my life it's my journey and i would love to really just like use this as a space to draw inspiration and also just use it as a space for all of us to you know learn together and regain inspiration you know what i mean so it is sunday and i'm going to be going grocery shopping today and then i've also like ordered a bunch of things off of like amazon so we've been here for some time now but there's just been so many changes so many things have changed in our lives over the past two years and i think it's time to kind of like upgrade certain um spaces within our home so our first project is going to be our bathroom so we're gonna tackle our master bathroom first i think there's certain things in there that we need to kind of like you know change around so that's what we're going to be doing today so my son is finally napping it is just us two today so it's a solo show he's been sleeping for an hour now and i was able to get a lot of things out the way i was able to shoot content for tiktok which i'm really excited about um by the time y'all see this my first youtube video would have gone live already and i'm so excited this is such a huge moment for me because i feel like the past few years i've just been sitting on so many things that i've wanted to do i've like wanted to do youtube for such a long time and it's finally happening so if you're even watching this like you're a real one um and make sure you check out the costa rica vlog because it was really good because i still have a lot of downtime i'm about to make some lunch for myself i'm gonna make some dumplings i'm gonna clean up the kitchen because i'm not gonna hold you the kitchen is a mess but what motherhood is sometimes you have to choose between a clean house or getting some work done or just watching netflix um and I do choose Netflix a lot, but in 2024, I'm standing on business. Um, so y'all help hold me accountable. So yeah. So 
so we've been living in this home for about two years now and we've done a lot of work in terms of just like you know getting um you know our main furnitures and things of that nature but i feel like when it comes to organization and just making sure that i have like you know systems to keep me organized um is not really there so my first project is going to be organizing our bathroom in the master bedroom when you are living in a space that's organized you tend to you know be more productive and i just for me at least for me you just tend to be more productive and your mind is also at ease you get what i mean so that's going to be our first project of the year Grocery shopping is like really therapeutic for me now because it's kind of like my downtime. Um, I'm out alone, just doing my own thing. So, yeah. Thank you. 